To create a new tenant, head to your partner level and the Acronis web console, where you can see um, a left side and a right side of information. Now, at first you will not have anything here. So you'll go to new customer, fill out the information about the company that you want to be your customer. Select 30 day trial evaluation or production. You can start your customer in the 30 day trial and it will automatically move pro to production after 30 days. You can choose to manage the account by service provider, or if it is the client that just has their own T IT company and wants to pay you for the services that you provide as a partner through Acronis, you can do managed by customer. Most of the time, you're going to choose managed by service provider. You can choose the MFA or two-factor authentication. Under advanced security settings, you can do a compliance mode if you like. There are limitations to this mode. If you click learn more here, you will see more of those, but it basically turns off cloud services. Under create administrator, you can use the login that's different from your email, so you can use your email multiple times. Um, you could use your email across multiple different customer tenants so that you can receive alerts to the same email, such as if you wanted to create an alias or account for monitoring at mycompany.com, then you could receive those alerts. Use some kind of nomenclature to create your login. And if you like, you can fill out the contact details. Choose next. Here you will get two options, one for protection per workload and one for per gigabyte. The per workload protection is based on the type and number of workloads. The cloud storage is charged separately and the local storage is not charged. You can select the advanced packs and storage locations that you would like to use. Same with per gigabyte. Per gigabyte is based on the cloud and local storage that you use, not based on the type of machine or how many machines you have. You can select the advanced packs that you like, the storage locations that you prefer, and that's that section. Then you can move to File Sync and Share. File Sync and Share provides a store capability that's encrypted content in the cloud to synchronize across all your devices. Again, you could do per user or per gigabyte. Per user is based on the number of users. Per gigabyte is based on the cloud storage. Advanced Automation is our PSA tool. It allows day-to-day -day operation management with CRM, service tests, billing, and more. Physical data shipping can be checked if you want to seed information to uh, through our professional services team through the cloud, so you can seed uh, your backups for large amounts of data. And then Notary, which is also part of Advanced File Sync and Share for notarization, can also be turned on. And that is how you create a customer.